here and be welcome back to just for five me hearties. Now, don't worry, I'm not gonna do that for very long this time. Um, so I was, uh, had a comment on my previous version of this video, uh, stating that they've changed the way this level works. Um, they just switched a couple of things around, uh, and actually made one part pretty much easier. Um, they also cleaned up the physics a lot. So, everything works just a little bit smoother now. Um, yeah, these doors previously were terrible. Um, first part of the mission, still going to work roughly the same. Go get your little saber here. Then you're going to head downstairs. And we're going to go over to this cannon. And we're going to cut this rope. You no longer need that. And I'm not going to pick those up because those do still have issues. I'll show you in a second. It's actually quite funny. Um, go ahead and grab my cannonball. And into the cannon it goes. And now we'll go pick those up. Because once you pick these up, they're physics reset, and they will just go insane. So, there we go. Now, I don't know if they added this in one of the recent updates. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know if they added this in one of the recent updates, but I really like it. You can now turn on a flashlight using your grip buttons. I don't know if that was there previously and I just never noticed it or what, but I'm a fan. Where are they? Oh, <laughs> over there. Well, it didn't do it this time. Last time I did that, it started spazzing out, spinning around, rolling around. Anyway, no big deal. Um, this one, this time, since I'm not too worried about it, since most people have probably figured this one out by now, you can actually still cheat this one. Um, need the white gem over here. Yeah. And then you just do that. Yeah, normally you would have to put the green gem here, the uh, red gem there, blue gem up there, I think, and then, yeah. Not going to worry about that this time. Go ahead and grab me that. Then we're going to go down here and steal the poor captain's key. Hello there, captain. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Still not going to answer you. Now, of course, I suggest you listen to those things just for the fun of it, if you're playing this for fun. Um, but as this is a walkthrough, again, don't really care. And this is where things start to diverge just a touch from where they used to be. Oh. Okay. Um, I was not expecting that. I bumped into my wall and... Now I'm on top of the ship for some reason. Um, so yeah, I was just going to set the thing down and I ran my controller into the wall. So, key still opens the same door. But now, this is in here. Previously, this part was in the cabinet over there. Um... So that's part of the secret. I'm not actually going to mess with that just yet, because you're not supposed to know yet. Uh, and then down here, the captain hit a little secret. So now, that goes in there. And the telescope is now in there, which is a much better fit, because when it was under there, it was a pain in the butt to get out. Um, so we're going to... And I've done something now. Okay. Well. I didn't get lost to the ages there. So we put our lens on our telescope. 
coming out to the gangway just because or plank just because it's the easiest location and you're gonna look up here you're gonna remember this order uh, so once you've got that info the telescope actually now no longer matters and I'm gonna have to pick that up since it went flying off into nowhere So yeah, there are still physics issues with this game, but it's nothing terrible. So that's the right order. And now, originally you had to do the, the numbers and lining up yourself. They just made it so it highlights it now. So 615435. We take that number. We go back down to where Dear Captain was. I love the flashlight thing, that's so good. I, I'm glad they did that. Because it gets dark in a couple of the places. But anyway. And then, it's just a matter of putting in your code. Yeah, that would have been faster going the other way. I know. And once again, there we have it, our helix. Alright guys, thank you so much for watching. Hope you all have a great day.